Hi, Haley, Mary from CFO on the go. I am going to show you the estimating and project manager management module now. This is one of my favorite modules as it just shows you how easy with just a few mouse clicks you can move an estimate from, you can go do a takeoff and move it into, export it into POs and into the general ledger and the cost of job cost and budget. It's just a really great module. So, Again, you can either work across the top right here, or if you prefer the tree, you can work on the tree. You can hide that menu, so you just have these up here. This is the estimating and scheduling module. And here is, you would start off everything right over here under takeoffs. So you would open it up and do a takeoff. I'm actually going to do pull up one that I've done just recently. You can do your takeoffs based on bid item or phases. And um, let's do, there you go. So we have the whole takeoff in here. Within this portion of the module, you can look at your bid summary. And you can make changes to the markup. You can say, hey, I want to have a 25% markup. And it's going to add everything to the total. Or you can say, I want to do a margin override if you want, or just a basic dollar markup. Uh, you can also, within this module, put in your overhead and profit. So you can say, I have a 10% overhead and I want to do a 20% profit. And you update it, and it's going to make changes. It's going to let you know whenever it's going to track when people have made changes, also. Uh, from here, Look at your takeoff details. We got everything in here. You can export out to purchase orders. You can do it by the job or by the phase, by a change order. You can es export it out to proposals. You can send out requests for information or requests for proposal if you use subcontractors for subcontractors. And um, out to the budget for the job. Save that. So I save it. And I'm going to export it out to the budget. There you go. Budget complete. So see, with a few mouse clicks, it's already now in the budget. So then you can click on the budget task right here. And that's the job that I was just, just exported is this one, the Greenfield Land. As you can see, I've got a lot of jobs in here for my data. And it's got all your different, you know, you got your hours, your materials, your site work. You look at the different phases and everything down here. Okay, so there's your budget. Now, also within the estimating and scheduling, you can do your schedules. And just by clicking on the schedule thing, here, let's look at there's one right here. You get your grid and Gantt charts. You can make changes to it. If something's going to have an effect on something else, it will make the change completely to it. And it'll push out whatever it's going to have, if it's a critical path item. So there's something within the project, or within the estimating module. And then you have your project module. You can look at your different jobs. The great thing about the project module is you have this project work center right here. You click on that and you're always able to see what's going on with all your jobs. Just a basic mouse click and you can see, hey, here's some field reports I have, you have payable invoices. You can drill down on these invoices. You can just highlight and drill down and see what that's all about. And uh, you can go directly to the transa transaction and see this is more on your side of it, not so much on the project management side of it or the field side of it. So if, if you want to really see the truth down to the details and the nitty gritty, you can see when you got everything. Here's your original budget, what you budgeted for changes, your total budget, and your cost percentage to budgets. Okay, so that's a really great portion on the project management side of it. Again, you have these work centers. All of these can be changed. Uh, you can say, you know, 
You can set it up so someone knows that if they're in one, they have to go to another, or they have to do something within that before they can do anything in the next one. You got your subcontracts and your chain. You can track all your change orders. And you can see what's going on with it. And you can tr see your purchase orders. You can pull it up by different, by jobs or by the vendor if you want and see everything that's there. Okay. Um, this is just a short, quick, easy one. I'm going to also have a separate video with the estimating for the standard estimating, which is a little bit higher up. This is the basic estimating that I showed you, though this project management and the Gantt schedule and all that is, is all included. The basic estimating is another module and all or the, or the standard estimating is another module. And that'll be on another video. If you have any questions, give me a call at 1-800-659-5851. Have a great weekend.